Okay, in this video, what we're gonna discuss is our cushion covers and some things that are gonna help as far as climate control um, or really helping with kind of that moisture wicking, moisture evaporating that may um, be beneficial. So when we look at cushion covers, there are different types of materials that are out there. So for example, here, you're gonna see this, this material. It looks really nice and wipeable, it is. Um, this is a Dartex material or Stealth Tech. And so with this material, it can be really easy to clean, but something to know is this is two-way stretch. So why does that matter? So whenever we're using a cushion cover, the purpose of our cushion cover is to help us get the best properties we can um, out of our cushion. So we talked about how there's different shapes or positioning components of our cushion. So we really want our covers to wrap around that cushion well, so we're getting the best benefit when we're seated. So this cushion cover is great if we need something really easy to wipe. Something to know with the two-way stretch is just notice how when I try to kind of pull up on it, it's not quite as springy. Um, it, it, I can pull it in different directions, but really just two ways. I have, I have kind of two ways that I'm pulling. So one thing we just wanna consider is that when you sit on this, just making sure you're able to sit down into that cushion and get good properties on, out of it. So what works um, a majority of the time really well is having a four-way stretch material. So for example, this four-way stretch, this is our cool core cover. And we'll talk what that means, um, talk about that in a little bit more in a second. But basically you can see how stretchy this is. So I have this good four-way stretch where this material is really gonna move with me. It's gonna wrap around my cushion to give me those properties. I can kind of see how it wraps the curves of the cushion when I'm sitting on it so that when I sit down, I'm getting the best properties out of this cushion in its shape. So with the cool core cover, like we talked about with kind of this four-way stretch, this is moisture wicking and moisture evaporating. So a lot of times when we're seated, um, things that can lead to kind of skin breakdown over time is just having a lot of moisture and heat there on our skin. Um, similar to if you think about if you spend a long time in the bathtub or a hot tub or a pool, you get kind of pruney. A lot of that's just from having that moisture there in our skin, it kind of breaks it down. So with this, when we're seated and we're getting a lot of that heat and maybe moisture, maybe we're sweating, maybe we have incontinence episodes, what happens with this fabric is it's wicking and evaporating that away. So it helps keep us cooler, which is gonna help protect our skin. So they've actually done things with this cool core to look at kind of infrared images as far as the heat, like the thermo cameras, and they're able to see um, that using this cool core uh, fabric that it actually dissipates that heat quicker and keeps the body cooler. Um, another consideration is going to be if we do have incontinent episodes and incontinence liner. So we talked about how we really like this four-way stretch fabric. Something that's available is this polyurethane four-way stretch liner. So you can see it's this kind of nice wipeable material but it has that four-way stretch property where it's gonna wrap around my cushion really well. And it has a zipper that when I zip it up, it's pretty um, sealed there. So it's gonna help prevent moisture from getting to my cushion. And I can sit on this as a cushion cover, or I can keep it underneath my primary top cover. We always wanna avoid adding things that are not part of your cushion. So not putting a towel on top, or sometimes, you know, the um, at rehab facilities, they may kind of have like a cotton layer that you sit on or they may refer to it as a chuck sometimes. We want to avoid putting extra things on or if you use a lift for your transfers, a foyer lift, making sure to remove it out from underneath your bottom and underneath your legs when you're seated in your chair throughout the day. One last thing just to discuss as far as climate and cooling mechanisms that are out there is sometimes there's cooling properties within your cushion. So for example, this is our glacial cushion, okay? So this is a skin protection cushion and you see these little squares of silicone gel. So that can be really nice. Um, it's wrapped on top, so it's pretty easy to wipe down, but this gel actually has cooling properties to it. So again, this in combination with, let's say that cool core fabric cover is really going to help to wick and evaporate that moisture and just keep you cooler, keep your skin more protected.